Okay. Audio check, quick audio check. We're gonna go ahead and do a sync check. So, one, two, one, two. And then one, two, one, two. Looks like we are good. I sorry, there's like a speck on my computer screen and it's literally right here on my forehead and I freaked out because I thought it was another pimple, but we're fine, we're fine. It's just it's probably just spit. Anyway. <laughs> Hello, good morning. I hope everyone is doing well today. We are live a bit early, and I'ma be honest. Um, Twitch Rivals is hosting like an IRL baking competition that starts at 2 p.m. PSG, 5 p.m. East or er, yeah, Eastern. 
and Loki. I'm so hyped because Cutie Cinderella is supposedly hosting it, so like it starts at two. So hope I'm not saying that I'm gonna end early, but hopefully we can get through stuff today by two p.m. That's why we're a bit early today. So guys, if you aren't already, make sure you have go live notifications on. If you are here, you are cool because you got the ping that we're live. Anyway, <clears throat> okay. So today's run is gonna be slightly different. There we go. Okay. So since I I assume we beat all the main like story levels because I think we're in like the um the level after the main Bowser. So I don't know how much longer we're gonna be doing SM3D World. Today might be the last day. I don't know. It depends on how long it takes to do the the levels, right? So something a little extra up here at the top is similar to Tuesday's stream. Something just a little bit extra for anybody who does choose to donate or gift today. If we get any 100-bit cheer, any sub, or gifted, or any $5 donation, I will immediately lose a 1-up. So that means, for example, if I'm grinding a level for 30 minutes, and I finally get to it, but someone cheers 100-bits, I have to die. It doesn't matter. That's the rules. That's the rules for today. If people like it, then we'll continue these rules for upcoming weeks. But get everything mode next. Maybe. It depends on, like... Oh, we also need to do the Bowser's Fury. I forgot about that too. So we probably got a few more weeks of 3D World before we do a different game. But that is the rules for today. Similar to Tuesdays, just something extra for anybody who does choose to donate. So that's how today is going to go. <clears throat> no, I don't want to do Peach. I wanted to do Toad. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm not going to freak out. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> Oh, um, it took me way too long to do this level last week. Okay, we have eight lives. We got a solid eight lives. I think we're good for now. What was nice about this level, I think it took like 30 minutes, but there was a lot of like mechanics that'll make you like get like coin grind a little bit, so it wasn't that bad. But let's head on to the next one. Before we get started, let's go ahead and get our first prediction of the day up. Okay. So, as always, will this level make me game over? And, similar to previous weeks, I am still gifting subs for every game over. The donos for, like, I will lose a 1-up is an additional thing. So, if someone wants to, like, drop 10 subs, then that means I lose 10 1-ups. Pretty simple, right? So, it's just an extra thing for today. Getting that prediction set up for you guys. Okay, so prediction is for, will this level make me game over? Believers is no and blue, and yes, doubters, you think I'm gonna lose, is red, okay? There we go. <laughs> Predict ah! Prediction is up, guys. Go place your bets. Hi, Mac. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. I know you were in stream yesterday, Mac, but that's what we decided up top here for the stakes for today. You guys really think we have 100 in doubt already? Is this level difficult? Okay, let's, let's just get to it. Prediction is up, guys. Go place your bets. I also added a few new 7 TV emotes last night, guys. I added a few, I think, the hyper ones. <laughs> let's see. Oh, yeah, I, I added hyper nopers because we had hyper notters. But the hyper nopers is really funny to me. <laughs> Tempting. <laughs> You know this game? Oh no, if Hacker says it's difficult, it's gonna be a doozy. Okay, let's get started. You guys got 10 more seconds left on the prediction. Go, go, go. Go, go, game book. Okay. <laughs> oh, you guys know I hate levels with the, the moving platforms. <laughs> oh! No! No, I hate this. I do not like this at all. You brought snacks just for this because you know it's going to be entertaining. Th then I'm going to take L after L. You think it's funny? I mean, granted, it is a little bit funny. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Honestly, not too bad. Oh, just coins? Fuck that. Ah! Okay. Oh, I see the star. No. Oh. oh, no. Okay. 
The first part is the easiest. Oh, oh yeah. I was just gonna say, this isn't so bad so far. No! Did I really? Okay, guys. Can I preface? I allotted myself $25 for this stream today. Meaning, I can only afford five game overs. I, I just want to say that. I just want to say that. So, I I'm genuinely... I, I literally- I don't throw for content, I'm not bad at video games on purpose, I am genuinely trying my best. <laughs> oh, is there really nothing here? Time to break the bank, I know, I know. <laughs> oh, that guy's hyper! Oh my god, he just kept going! Okay, good thing I chose Peach for this level. I literally would not be able to do it. Oh my god, I forgot the bombs. Okay, I always forget that I can dash in this game. Okay, it's a good thing I chose Peach. It's a good thing I chose Peach. Okay. Oh, it's okay. The big guys are the hyper bombs. Got it. Should we go for the star? Should I do it? No, I'm not doing it. I'm not. I'm skipping that one. I'm skipping it. It's literally not worth it. Okay, it's fine. I don't know why I'm yelling so early. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. I'm so- literally- I'm not stupid. I'm not- I'm not- let's not talk bad about myself. Let's not do that today. Oh. <laughs> the, the way the guy just stopped was really funny. Can I talk to him? No! I just wanted to talk to them. Okay, fine. Please be a one-up. Please, for the love of god. Just two coins. Okay. Okay, dude. Wait, I, I saw a boost on the bottom of this platform. Yeah, let's go. No! I wasn't going fast enough. Okay, noted. I have to... full we'll send. No, we don't need it just yet. We don't need it. Almost fell off, we're fine. <clears throat> okay, I made it, I made it. Moving platforms and jumping. <laughs> okay, I see the portal at the end. I see it. Oh, wait, I could change the POV. I didn't know I could change the POV. Okay. So I think I have to wait for one more rotation. Now we go. First try, baby! Checkpoint. Thank god. Okay, I'm gonna get some water. That was great. That was fucking great. <clears throat> See, checkpoints are nice and comforting, but then it's also like, there's more to the level. Like, we're probably not even halfway done.
Oh, really? Just a coin? No power-ups? That's bullshit. Wait, can we take note? Peach is literally shaking when she crouches. She is so scared right now. I mean, I would be too. Honestly. No! I missed! I missed. I missed. Okay, I'm gonna merc all these guys first just to be safe. Because I honestly can't afford to take one more hit. Okay, we're good. We're set. Oh, there's probably a star right here to the left, right? I see it now. Oh, no. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, it's a stamp. Do we need it? Okay, there's probably a way to get up here. But is it worth? No, I- no, I'm not doing it. I'm not- I'm not wasting. I only have four lives left. I'm not wasting. But that's cool in the background. Little circus thing. Okay, stop zooming in. Okay. Let's go! Okay, there's a split second when they all, like, line up. <laughs> I'm running out of time! No, I, I cannot be this close. No, I fell, I fell. Fuck. Okay, we we're probably gonna run out of time either way, so you know it's fine. I was dilly dallying earlier. I missed! No, I missed again! Okay, we're fine. I need to figure out the timing on this one. Right here? Oh, okay, right there, right there! Please be the end. Oh, the star's right there. Hi, Emmy, welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. Oh, can we talk to her? Okay, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Okay, that level wasn't that bad. Not that bad, honestly. It only took, what, five lives? But not that bad. Okay, will this level make me game over? No shot. But I didn't get the star. I know. I don't think I got any stars in that level. See, I'm playing to survive, not to get stars, honestly. Oh, we can play Rosalina? Holy shit! 100% or nothing? Fuck no. Actually, never. <laughs> 10k halfway, let's go, hacker. Oh, I made a command for the tweet. So if you're new to stream... You can spend 20k channel points to make me post a Twitter draft, and I just linked the last one that chat made me tweet. <laughs> okay. Let's go ahead and get on our next prediction up and running. Will this next stage make me game over? Prediction is up, go place your bets, chat. <clears throat> I think... Once I beat all the main levels, then I'll go play off stream to like get all the stars again. Oh! I wasn't even looking. Oh, dude. I, okay, I don't think I can make that. I don't think I can jump high enough. 
Why are these levels so difficult? I, I hate stuff on moving platforms genuinely so much. Okay. Oh my god, it's so- it's so fucking fast! No. Oh. oh, he's gonna hop on here. He fell off. Close the ratio. Another one. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I forgot to choose Rosalina. Oopsie. I'll do her next round. Nothing up here. Coins, bullshit. I got ripped off, jabated, scammed. <laughs> Wait. Which way do. Okay, that one rolls to the left, I see. Yeah, we're back. Like I said yesterday, there's a lot of, like, windstorms in Washington right now, so... As long as stream doesn't drop, we're still here. Because, like, I was biking this morning- God, fuck, why did I pause? I should've kept playing! As I was biking this morning... Like, the winds were fucking strong. I was struggling. Because part of the trail that I was on, like, there's some open area. And I was biking against wind, and it was very difficult. So I- I- I got a lot more, like, cardio than I needed today. Fuck, I have no more lives. I have no more lives left. <laughs> no! Okay, we're fine, we're fine. I'm gonna do this first try, first try. <laughs> I hate playing as Peach. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, okay. Does this level make me game over? Yes, it did. We had no believers. Honestly, I would have doubted too. Okay, also, I game over, so that means I gift chat a sub. Let's see who's gonna get it. <clears throat> Let's see. Ooh, I don't know who that is, but Paco, enjoy app reviewing and sub only emotes. Let's fucking go. Oh, I need to have how many game overs on the screen, don't I? Mm, where can I put that? Ah, we don't need it. We don't need it. It's fine. Okay, let's go back to it. Another try. <laughs> okay, we're, we are at 1L for the day. Oh wait, I want to change! There we go. Okay, Rosalina does not float. Oh, that's cute! Oh my god, that's so cute. I assume there's secrets in those locks, but I don't think it's worth. Okay, this is probably the first star. Oh. Ooh, I see it. 
No, I missed the one up. Fuck. Oh, jump and spin? Oh shit, that's actually cool. Double jump? Dude, that's fucking sick. Thank you, hacker. <laughs> oh no, oh no. Here we're dodging, we're dodging. We are dipping, we are dodging. Ooh, I slid right between them. <laughs> oh, we got tired. <laughs> I wanted to see how long you keep going. Okay, we're about we're about halfway through. I see I see a checkpoint right there. We're doing good. We're doing pretty solid right now. Checkpoint BB. Oh, oh no. Oh, I see the star. I see it. Bye. Easy two for three. Completionist run now, guys. <laughs> that <laughs> well she did <laughs> yeah I like Ros I like Rosalina's colors a lot because it kind of matches like my sea foam green that I use for like branding and stuff I like any pastel color oh fuck oh no how do I make it roll back there it is okay oh no I see a secret. Oh, please, just just give me one ups. I hate when they give me fucking coins. I mean, freaking. <laughs> I'm out of time. Ooh, one more time. Cool, Pago. Did you see that? <laughs> oh my god, only ten seconds. Absolute bullshit. Um, I can't make that jump. I understand the mechanics, though. Like, the, the no! <laughs> but It's just gonna be a matter of, like, nailing it and, like, the timing. No! Yeah, I was trying to speedrun. I was dashing. And then I started crashing. That, that was stupid. That was actually DUM. You could like blow into like the like the Nintendo 3DS. <laughs> it's such like a weird, interesting mechanic, wasn't it? Oh, wait, that was cool. Like it's essentially an attack. I didn't know she had it. That was an attack. That's actually pretty fucking sick. Oh, I think I like slid under because I was too small. I think if I was big, I wouldn't that would not have happened. Oh! Oh no, 
I was trying to kill it! Frick! I'm gonna start concentrating now. No, I was, try I was trying to get it that time. Okay, there we go. That was unfair. I, I thought if I was big it would- Because, like, last time it stopped the blocks. Like, I don't understand why I slipped through it again. This is actual bullshit. It's not consistent. I'm gonna get it this time. I'm gonna do it this time. Okay, I think the technique is- I, I have to jump. I think I gotta jump in order to like recenter it. There, the flagpole is right there. I can see it. I am so close. Okay. Yeah, I, I kind of want to like. Okay, so I just have to keep rolling. Similar mechanic to before. See how I like visibly, visibly like jumped in my chair. Yeah, don't share if you feel like it's oversharing, Issa. I respect myself. <laughs> yeah, if, guys, if you feel like you're oversharing, then don't share. Like, <laughs> pretty simple, right? Fuck! No! No! 
Okay, I, I figured it out. It's just... I hate when you have to, like, dodge shit. Okay, that's another one, guys. Cool, a master of games got the gifted sub. Let's fucking go. If I break my own sub goal today, I'm gonna cry. I forgot to change the color. There we go. Never give up. Yeah, never give up. Okay, this is actually so cute. Did I really lose the checkpoint? No, you're fucking right. No. <laughs> Hey, this first section wasn't that bad, honestly. So I'll be fine. I'll I'll be a okay. Look, coins. I got coins. I'm so fucking rich. I love this game. Yeah. Guys, like I said, I only budgeted $25 for today. And I only have... Oh, I lost the star too. I only have like... Um, $50 in my checking, so I, I can't, I, I can't, I can't go over budget today, guys. I cannot afford it. I mean, we'll just have to ask! No, 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 I'm gonna live, I'm gonna live! Okay, we're fine, we're fine. So if we go over budget, we have to ask the nice man at the bank for another loan. Just kidding, taking out personal loans is a scam. Don't do it! I know I need to spin. I know I should sprint, but I can't fucking do it. It's too much for my little brain to handle. Pressing more than one button at a time in quick succession makes me fucking get a headache. Thank you for clipping the stream, Issa. I appreciate it. But honestly, personal loans are a scam. Don't do it unless you literally really need to. Like, especially like third party, like personal loan companies. Don't do it. They say, ooh, we'll boost your credit score, but not the right credit score, because there's different types of credit scores, kiddos. They don't teach you this in school, but there are different kinds. So when they market it as, ooh, you'll be more likely to get approved for, like, a car or a home. No, it's a different type of credit score. Look it up, guys. Do some research. Anyway, that's all. That That is your life lesson of the day. Personal loans from third-party companies are a scam. Not worth. <laughs> Good to- Yeah, I think I just got too heated talking about personal loans that I got distracted. Didn't I literally say this first part is a breeze? It's literally so easy. Ignore us? <laughs> No, no, no. I, I can't ignore chat for too long. You, you guys aren't being mean, so I, I don't I don't feel like I need to ignore you guys yet. You know what you could do to distract me is just put, like... What was it? I think it was Batty who started it, but it was like, We spin to distract. <laughs> that, that was some good, wholesome spam, you know? No! <laughs> I need some water. I I need maybe I'm dehydrated. Maybe that's it.
Okay, I think part of my issue earlier was I was dashing when I didn't necessarily need to dash. So I think just walking is the way to go for now. Oh, they're so close! Okay, we're back here, back here. Easy! Checkpoint, baby! Yeah, good! Okay, everything that Rosalina says is like really nice, like positive reassurance and encouragement. No! 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 Oh, I'm gonna lose the boomerang too. Frick. Okay, first try. We're gonna do a first try. Oh! Okay, we got one. That's a two. Okay, jump to re-level it. Jump over, easy! Squish this bee! I didn't really spin would kill them. Somebody write this down, that is game changing. Oh my god, how- Okay. I know you guys don't backseat too much, I really appreciate it. But how did- I, how did that not register to me earlier? Oh, there's a cherry power-up? Don't they? No! No! Yeah, that was unfair. Literally unfair. Yeah, I, I still think it's kind of rude how I can, like, fall through cracks. It's- it's unfair. It is rigged. We need a recount. Okay. It's almost like we're supposed to use Rosalina. I know, right? Hmm. Who knew? Fuck me. Oh my god. Wait, I think I can get enough coins for another life. Only 18 more, 18 more. Five more. Duh! Duh, and me, please, please. No. I had ninety nine coins, literally ninety nine coins. Oh my god, Poltergeist enjoys ad previewing and some bully emotes. Let's fucking go! Yeah, let's go back to it, guys. Never give up. Yeah, never give up! Can we just make that a sound bit and we can play that anytime Megan gets like really upset? Thank you for clipping the stream, I appreciate it, Issa. Oh, and we lost the checkpoint too, didn't we? Oh no. <laughs> Can I also just say thank you for not not donating, guys? Because I would be fucking crying if I had less lives than I do now. I will be honest. Um, one up. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I'm gonna do this section first try. First try, guys. We're gonna get that checkpoint easy clap. Okay, getting literally every single coin I can get. We are broke bitches, we need to get every coin. 
Okay, not those. I, I don't need those. It's not worth falling off. So I'm, I kind of know what I'm doing. But look, I got the first section first try easy. I told you guys, I'm good at this game. Yeah, exactly. Strong start. Strong start. We're on track. Good. But we're gonna get that boomerang. We're gonna be so fucking sick. swirly, but we had the boomerang. Dude, I'm cursing a lot today. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not supposed to go down here. That's it. That's why I got stuck. Oh my god, I'm right there. I'm literally right there. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. I finally I'm finally at the end. That was brutal. Clear time, 2.45. Oh, no. Has it always told us our clear time? <clears throat> okay. That was pretty good. We got... We got two levels done so far. But hey, talking about levels... You guys can level up your Twitch viewing experience by subscribing! Because an ad break is coming. I have to fulfill my contractual obligations and run a few minutes of ads. But you can avoid that ad break by subscribing for just $4.99, just $5 a month. I coughed up two subs to chat today, so if you can afford it, why not drop a sub for me? You will get ad previewing and cool sub only emails. Or, if you have an Amazon Prime, you can link it to your Twitch account and get a free Amazon Prime sub every month. I know my Prime sub went out to Randy the Games. I know, I thought it was pretty fucking clever. I thought it was good. Yeah, actually good. See? Comedy. <laughs> I think... I think it's good. I'm getting better. I'm getting better. Anyway, or if any Oilers, now is the time to drop some subs so non-sub clubs can get ad previewing. Anyway, get a snack. Get some water if you need it. We will see you guys in a few... That transition was pretty solid. That was pretty fucking good. Yeah, I see a Gamba. We're gonna do Gamba. Bucheri, <laughs> okay. No, we did two levels. It took- we did two levels in an hour. It did not take one hour to do one level. It took two hours- what? Nope. Took one hour to do two levels. Two, okay. Yeah, we started early. We started early today. Fuck! I mean, frick. Sorry, I'm cursing literally way too much today. I'm sorry, guys. 
There is a reason why I don't clip my SM3 to row clips. <laughs> okay. He got two of each, I guess. That's fine. I mean, that's- that's aight. <laughs> oh. We can go in here. Oh wait! We can make her tool too! Well, that was cute. Okay, we are back to eight lives right now. We're doing great. Okay, let's go ahead and get our next prediction. Up and running. Will this new level make me game over? Go place your bets, chat. Yeah, I think the next Mario game we're doing is Mario Galaxy. That is going to be next on our list. Okay, we got 69 in Believe and 500 in Doubt. Okay, okay. Okay. 569. Nice. Nice. Let's go. Anybody want to go all in on Doubt? Oh, it's a timed one. This, this can't be... Of course, of course, of course! I see how we're playing. I see. I see how it is. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna go for the speedy platforms because that always trips me up. So rude, so rude. Yeah, there's definitely a star up there. Oh, it was close. Is it just gonna keep going? It keeps going. It keeps going. I just have to jump on the pole. Uh, okay, I got it now. Yeah, the music is nice, but the flapping of the wings is low-key annoying. But, you know, we can only hear when we get close to it, so you know it's fine. Time. No, not again. Yeah, that was obviously a debate. That was obviously a bait. I should not have gone that way. I forgot to turn. No, I I still got four lives left. I can do it. I can do it. Oh. 
Yeah, this is it. I'm gonna do it this time. So you tell me I have to long jump, but I literally don't know how. And if I knew how, I don't think I could do it. I see what I have to do now. Wonderful. Come on, I almost had it. I ran into it. Come on. I'm opening well today. We got stay away from bad touch, bad touch. Yeah, I have a whole thirty seconds to catch him. Finally, finally. It this does this just go on forever? <laughs> okay. That wasn't as bad. Wasn't as bad. You know, I did it. I did it. I didn't game over. Well, we had eleven percent believers, you guys. Believers eating good today. The one time they are eating good. <laughs> How many levels are there? Okay, so... I'll try and get as many done as I can today. Oh, prediction! Your new prediction is up, guys. Go place your bets. Will this stage make me game over? Right now- Oh, we have three lives. That is not ideal. Oh, it puts him out. Easy. I was like, why are they just exploding? <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, I can't get any more, Sag.
Okay, this looks like a level that won't be too difficult. Like, this one looks, looks like a level that's for funsies. Oh! I didn't think he'd come back. Yeah, don't jinx it. I'll, I will try my best. Fuck, I, I literally ran it right into it. Frick. Okay. Here we go again. Oh, we had a power up. I don't want them to get up to run over here. Oh, I didn't want to kill him. Oopsie. Yeah, go go this way, go this way. Oh, it just opens up the path more, doesn't it? What am I doing? I I should stop. No! I thought there was a <laughs> I thought there'd be like a fence! <laughs> no! Yeah, that was, that was D.U.M. a little bit. Ooh, I see the stamp down here. Wait, how do I get him down here? Oh. Yeah, I feel like they have to go around. Oh! They're right there! I ran right into him. Oh, it's just a jumpy pad! Not worth- look, I thought there'd be a secret, I thought there'd be something sick, something cool. Oh, I wasn't even trying there. No, I jumped too soon, I jumped too soon! See, I'm a personality streamer, not a gamer. I play games to have fun, not to go pro. <laughs> we got them all. Forgetting that Rosalina has that attack. Yeah, there's definitely a secret here, for sure. Ooh! Oh, oh bro, 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 bro. Camera mod check? <clears throat> Come back. Oh, there we go. Hello. Okay, sound is there too. Okay, cool. We're back. Oh, I see, I see. No, I missed! I missed! Oh, 
I just have to be faster. Yeah, that was fun. That was cute. Favorite cereal? Um, I have to say muffin tops, which I don't see them at the store anymore, and it makes me sad. Or like cocoa pebbles. It's another good one. I like cereals that make like the milk flavored after you're done eating. What is that? It's kind of like cinnamon toast crunch, but instead of like cinnamon flavor, it's like blueberry muffin flavored. So it has like artificial blueberry pieces and then um what'd you call it? Like just regular sugar on it. Oh no no Fuck I didn't think it'd fall Okay, we somehow have to get 50 coins. It's doable, or we have to beat the level. One of the two. I did not realize we only had zero lives. Hey! Coins last time? Rip off. Go away, go away. Can I pick it up? Oh, I don't think I can pick it up with the tanuki. I forgot that the blocks disappeared with the bomb. Have I hit my budget already? <laughs> I think this is game over number four today. Sag. Oops, fuck. Wrong thing. Yeah, let's see who's gonna get it. Let's see who's gonna get it. I don't know who that is, but enjoy your ad previewing and some little emotes. Oh, okay. I. Okay. I can only afford one more game over today, guys. I can only afford one more. <laughs> just, just one more. That's all you can do. Oh, we lost the checkpoint too, didn't we? Wait, but there's another Gamba! Is there another, like, gamble after every game over? Is that how it works? If so, that's great. Oh, this is the worst one. I should stop gambling. Oh yeah, prediction. <laughs> we had 86% believe, Sag. I'm sorry, believers. The one time when there's more believers than doubters. It's not commonplace. Okay, two for two. Ooh, three! Okay! We're up seven lives, baby! Yeah. Okay, let's go again! Let's go! Yeah, I'm just gonna speed run this first section. I don't care about getting the blocks, I just wanna murk these footballers. Okay, they got one hit on me.
Okay, I think we can definitely get this star this time. Be back here again. Good. Oh! I didn't see him there. I don't think I can do that one unless I can pick up the bomb. So I think the issue is I don't I don't think I need the tanuki. I think that is the problem. Yeah, I don't think I can make that jump. Go away, go away. Bye. I'm not doing I'm I'm literally not I'm gonna do anymore. I'm I'm skipping that fucking star. I know I can long jump, I know I can trick jump, but I- I can't do it. I literally can't do it. I wanna be a pro Mario Kart player, not a fucking pro SM3D World speedrunner. Oh wait, you can't pick it up with the- Okay, so you can't pick it up with the new Tanuki. Secret? Oh, okay, we can't wall jump. Ooh, do we're fucking rich? I'm too short. Oh wait, I forgot a ground punch up was a thing! <laughs> I love this game. Whoa! Oh wait, we got all three stars for this level! Dude, let's go! It's been a while since that's happened. Finally, a big W. Woohoo! Woo Yay! Yeah. Get on to the next. Let's go ahead and get our new prediction running. Will this level make me game over? 
It is up and running. Go place your bets, chat. Okay, let's go. So satisfying hitting them all in one shot. Shortcut, maybe? Or here, okay. Yeah, I think Rosalina has to be my favorite character to play. Like, knowing that she has an attack on her own that's so OP. Granted, I haven't been able to use it well. But still, it's super nice. And it's really cute how she says, like, oh! To star, easy. It's cute how she's like super encouraging whenever like you game over. Okay, lava is insta death, now we know. Wait, one shot? Easy! I forgot that boomerangs come back around. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I walked right into it, didn't I? We'll use the tanuki. No, it's not that the game hates me, it's I hate the game. It's a mutual relationship we have right now. Back together. Oh, we lost one. <laughs> oh, okay, no. <laughs> I like the game. Oh, I just have to wait. Oh my god, if I would have just waited, I would have been a okay.
It's an okay. I'm using it. I took a hit. Oh, there's so many bees. I took another hit. No! No! I should have just gone for the end. I should have gone for it. No regrets, YOLO. <laughs> I completely missed him all. Okay, it's not coming back. Why didn't it come back that time? It's kind of weird. Okay, my goal is to keep the boomerang the whole map. That is my life goal, my life endeavor right now. YOLO in a while. I know, I think when I was younger, like junior high and like high school, that's when YOLO was like popping off. But now it's kind of like irrelevant. Like nobody says that. It feels like everybody in chat is just a simp for Rosalina and you know, I don't mind that. <laughs> Whenever I play Mario Party, I always have to play as Rosalina. Last one. Three stars, baby. How did I not get the stamp? I got it last second. Yoshi and Boo are better. I guess. Is it really just coins here? Oh yeah, we got all three stars and the stamp. Surprisingly. Improvement? Oh shit. Okay, I feel like I missed out. I missed out. There we go. Easy. Another completionist level. Let's go. Yeah, I don't think I've played Luigi too much in this game. I usually go with Peach or Toad. Will this stage make me game over? No way. We had no believers that time, Sag. Mm. Let's see what time is it. It's nearly 12. I think we can do... Okay. We can do a poll today. Do we want to try and finish the rest of these levels? Or do Animal Crossing? So either we, similar to last week, we could just do all, um, SN3D World and then Animal- or no Animal Crossing, or we can do this last level and then do Animal Crossing.
I'll let you guys decide today, because I'm fine with either. Okay, poll is up, guys. Just S in 3D World is if you want to not do Animal Crossing today. And then the second option, last level, then Animal Crossing. We'll do this last level today, and then we'll switch gears to Animal Crossing. Oh. So go vote, guys. It's up for five minutes so we, you guys can, like, ponder about it. We got one vote for each good one, guys. Let's go. Also, prediction is up for this level, too. <clears throat> we got a pole and a gamma right now. <laughs> yeah, Rosalind <and> spins. <laughs> oh. Oh, that was cool! Did you guys see that? I jumped and I ground pedded. That was sick. Oh, I tried to do it again. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many of them. And they're all following me. These are all my adoring fans. They love me so much. Oh, okay, they're big. They are big. But so are we! Oh, we got a star! Oh, we got the stamp, not the star. That was it. Checkpoint BB? Okay, as of right now, we are halfway through the poll. We have three votes for just SM3D World and then two for Animal Crossing. So, chat decides what we do today. I have to get the wind. Oh, I missed it. Damn. Oh, it is the end. This is a short one. Oh! I threw. Again, again, okay. I like the spin, but also it messes up my dash. That was pathetic. <gasps> oh my god! Thank you for the gifted sum, Emmy Beef. I appreciate it. Oh, I have to lose a one up now. Fuck. I just have to, I have to immediately die. <laughs> but thank you, Emmy. Gonna get your name right now. End of stream. So look forward to that. Okay. 
Will this level make me game over? No shot. I have a boatload of lives. <laughs> Fellow plus one plus ratio. <laughs> yeah, okay. Okay, looks like Chad has voted we're doing SM3 d World. So we'll do Animal Crossing next week. Um, offline, if I still have that open villager plot, then I'll, I'll grind for Aurora some more. I promise you guys that. So I'll do the offline today. And if I find her, I'll post it on Twitter and then a picture of me crying. Okay, on to the next one. So if we're just going to do SM3 d World today, I think we'll play for maybe an hour and a half more. Let's go. Oh, prediction! Okay, will this level make me game over? Go place your bets, chat. Okay, I also have to immediately die. So I need to find out how to how to video game myself. Hey, once again, thank you, Emmy, for the gifted sub. I lost the one up, Sag. We still got 12 left though. Oh, it's a ghost level. I, I hate these ones. Are we in a cemetery? Okay, I want to try and get this guy with the snowball. I don't know what that did. Oh, there's Toad. Oh, fuck! No! <laughs> Is there any way- Okay, there's gotta be a way for me to kill the ghost. Okay, maybe... Oh, there's keys, too, I didn't realize. Not this one. <laughs> I almost ran right into it. This door? Okay, nope. Oh, I already went in this one. God damn it. Are ya? Hey, let's go. I see it. It's next to the tree with the timer on the left. I see it. Yeah, there's also something glowing in the distance on the right. A flashlight, maybe? Oh, th this will scare the booze. This will scare the ghost. Okay, we're gonna go save Toad! Yay! Got a star! Okay, the last coin was over here somewhere. Right- oh, wait, that's just a normal coin. Right. Oh, right here, okay. Got him! Easy! 
The music is very calming, though. <laughs> you always choose the wrong option? No. Oh! I thought we died. You always seem to get a lot of points in the Mario Kart predictions, though, let's be honest. Because SM3D World well, is a toss up, like, it usually takes me a while to learn the mechanics. But once I get it, I get it, you know? Oh, okay, that's not it. Are they both gonna be debates? Probably. Oh, actually not. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Oh yeah, I have no idea what I was supposed to do there. Am I out of time? Another one of these. I can eat this shit. Oh! Oh my god, I did it! Holy shit! Coins, okay. That was actually perfect how I did that shit. I was not even trying. small. If I would've hit, I would've fucking died. In a video game. <laughs> Easy. Easy. Sag doubters. Okay, I know Chad voted. That we would do SM3D World all day, but if we only have one level left, we could do a little bit of Animal Crossing. We could do like a little bit, like a little taste. Oh no. You're telling me. We need 30 more. Thirty more. If that is the case, then I'll I will grind over the weekend. I will do that over the weekend. Oh no. I hate this. If that is the case and I need thirty more fucking stars, I'll play over the weekend. I think that is fair. That way next week we can I'll have enough stars. We get handshakes. Does that sound good? Oh, I forgot I can't jump. <laughs> okay, I don't think we need to do a prediction on this one because I literally don't think it's possible for me to die 14 times on this level. That would be near impossible. Dies 14 times. That would be really sad. You gotta go, no problem. We'll see you later, hacker. Hope you enjoyed your stay, and we'll see you next time, man. Enjoy chatting with you as always, hun.
Don't touch it. Bad touch. Wait, I missed the star. On that. One more rotation. Oh. <laughs> I was back here. Yeah, okay. Okay, so this is awkward. Um, I don't necessarily want to coin ground on stream because, like, I I'm not good at the game, so I feel like that'd be brutal to watch. So over the weekend, I will get 210 stars. That way, next week we can do that final level, and then maybe potentially start with the Bowser's Fury. Yeah, exactly. We're gonna- we're gonna switch gears to Animal Crossing. <laughs> so, once again, thank you to anybody who gifted. Thank you, MEV, for gifting a sub. We did lose a 1-up. Wasn't too bad, though. We still got a solid 13. Let's go ahead and switch gears to... an ad break. <laughs> we're gonna switch gears to an ad break. <laughs> and we're about another hour into stream. So I have to fulfill my contractual obligation and run a few minutes of ads. But you can avoid that ad break by subscribing for just $4.99, just $5 a month. Skip your coffee today and get ad previewing all month long. Or you can link your Prime account to your Twitch account get a free Amazon Prime sub every month. My Prime went out to Radio Games this month. Um, or any secret Oilers, now's the time to gift. That way non-subs can get ad previewing. Um, I'm going to be setting up Animal Crossing, so it's going to take a few minutes anyway. So, yeah, get a water. Get a snack if you need it. Okay. Go ahead and save and switch gears. I think today... Sorry, my earbud was bothering me. I think we can do... Like, we can probably grind for Aurora again if we didn't get a new villager come in. I think that'll be the plan for today. Okay, I'm changing my title. Let's, let's do the same thing as yesterday. <laughs> I lost her. Uh, uh, Rora. There we go. Okay. So if you're new to stream, how Animal Crossing works, um, I think we're just going to be searching for Aurora today if we have that plot still open. If not, we do our daily more, it's just chatting vibes, so feel free, ask questions, talk to me, that type of thing. Dude, I am so glad we didn't game over more than five times. I think we game over it only four times, so I did not break the bank. I was within budget today. Thoughts on Burger King? Icky. The only thing that looks somewhat appetizing is their chicken fries. Everything else kind of mid. Granted, I haven't had Burger King in like... Probably like literally 15 years. Okay. Oh, let's turn off the overlays. We're not doing SM3D World anymore. There we go. 
Okay. Hello there, everyone. Right now in Timberland, it is 12.15 p.m. on Thursday, May 19th, 2022. Now for today's announcements. Oh! First, I have an ordinance update. I'm happy to announce that special rules called ordinances can now be enacted here in Tiblet. Ordinances are a great way to help improve the everyday lives of all our residents. They're quite a lot of responsibility, however, and, and anyone enacting one should understand everyone's needs. That's why our resident representative, Megan, will be in charge of ordinances on Tiblet. How exciting! Megan? Megan Modcheck? If you're listening, I can't wait to see what you'll change. If anybody has any questions about ordinances, come come please come and see me at Resident Services. Moving on. Oh, I'd like to tell everyone about a new kind of tour available. Starting today, residents can go on boat tour to un un uninhabited islands. These tours are a little different than the ones they offer at the airport. You'll get to board a boat and enjoy at the ocean breeze as you make your way to your destination. There are a lot of uninhabited islands out there, but they can only be reached by boat. Rumor has that there are plenty of DIY materials on these islands. And even straight things buried in the ground. Oh, we can get the little... The little, like, knickknacks that dance, I think. Sounds mysterious, doesn't it? These boat tours are available once a day using miles. Interested residents should head down to the island pier and speak to the boat captain. Oh my god, there's so much, so many nudes today. Yeah, guy words. Or gyroids. Gyroids? It sounds like gyrate and it makes me feel uncomfy. <laughs> um, and to wrap things up today, I have an event announcement. In honor of International Day, or International Museum Day, the museum is hosting a stamp rally through the end of the month. There are even participation prizes. I hope everyone heads over to the museum and joins in the rally. That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. Okay, we have a lot of shit today. <laughs> oh, also, um, what was it? Ellie gave me this dress and it's really cute. All the girlies give me the cutest clothes. Okay, what did I- Oh, I didn't move his house, did I? No, I did. I did. Oh, he's here, he's here. Th there was so much going on today. Yeah, I don't need- ooh, maybe I should start buying shrubs now that we're actually decorating. Ooh, find the sugar cane! I want all of the sugar cane. Yeah. Before we get started, let's buy some shit. Spend our millions. Okay, I want to buy at least 20. So, let's see. Oh, there's blue azaleas. Oh my god, they're so pretty. Yeah, I agree. It would be... It would make things too easy if we could type in the amount we wanted, honestly. Kind of like with crafting, that would make life infinitely better. But no way they're going to do that for us. No way. No shot. I personally love any blue or purple flower IRL. So these blue hydrangeas, I need them. I literally need them. Okay, let's buy... Let's buy 10 to start out with. See, I feel like my mom right now. Like, she'll go to the store and she will come home. Like, the other day she came home with, no joke, like 100 tree starters. And I was like, Mom, what are you doing? She's like, I want to have an orchard one day. I was like, I understand that. But do we have room for a hundred tree starters? No, we don't. But she was like, they were like a dollar each. I'm like, Mom, I know, but still, we don't need a hundred trees. A <laughs> hundred, yeah. It's because my parents, they have a property in Washington somewhere. I'm not going to say where. 
but oh it is sold oh no bye Issa we'll see you next time good luck with studying um but they're hoping to like build an orchard so that way in like 20 years we'll be fucking rich <laughs> but yeah oh it's sold damn who's flow okay well do we still want to go searching for Aurora? Because if we go searching for Aurora and, fi and we find her, then we have to kick someone else out. Let's see who we have in the village. Okay, for sure, for sure. I want to keep Ellie, Bubbles, Kiki, and Raymond. Everyone else is kind of eh. Wait, Flo is a penguin. Are they the purple one? I think I've gotten Flo before. Okay, so there's only a few villagers that I want to keep. So I think we can't afford to do searching for Aurora today. Um, let's see. Let's drop some stuff off. Are there, like, random villagers on the expedition boats as well? Or is it just through the Nook Miles? Oh, I wanted to sell shit. That's what I was doing. Shell stuff. Sell. <laughs> I said shell. Sell stuff. Okay. Yeah, because I remember in my old save, I can't remember if there were villagers on the Expedition Islands, but we can try that out first and see if there are any. If not, then we can do like one or two, like, Nook Mile tickets. Yeah, I kind of want to change my clothes first, because like, the red shoes are clashing with the red violet dress and I'm not liking it. I think that's cute. I like the sun hat so much. Just the bow is so cute. Okay, let's go back to work. No more dilly dallying. Okay, so let's see. I think it's on the left side. Yeah, the port's on the left side. Okay, so let's go check that out. Oh, we can also do the museum thing, too. And there's so much today. It's a good thing we played Animal Crossing today. There's a lot of shit going on. Our island is popping off. <clears throat> now what do we have here? Yours be a face I've not seen before. Name's Captain. What's yours? Megan, is it? Yeah, that'd be a nice fancy to name that. Well, I came here to ferry folks on tours to various wee islands in exchange for miles. Might even take you where there are... <laughs> Might even take you... <laughs> where there be rare treasures. We tours go to places you can only reach in my boat. I can take you almost any time. Let me know when you're ready to sail. I wanna go right now, sir. Hmm, you ready to take a tour? Round trip fare cost you 1,000 miles. You ready to go? I wonder if, like, miles are worth, like, currency. Oh, wait, is miles, like, the cryptocurrency 
of Animal Crossing? Is that what it is? Yeah, that's kind of a it's kind of late to ask this question <laughs> it's about to lose value exactly <laughs> like crypto is crashing right now wait do I have a stonks down emote oh I don't I have I have the stonks up but down <laughs> Shit! Oh my god, finally tulips! I think that the tulips were the last flower we needed. Oh, dude, that's so fucking sick! Finally! Finally! <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna take all of these tulips home. Okay, in actuality, we probably don't need all of them, but at least, like, probably, like, ten. Today's a good day, man. Okay, I have my question book here. That way I'm not just sitting here saying nothing. Oh, I was watching- okay. I don't watch a lot of, like, Soda Poppins live streams, but, like, I've gotten in the habit of, like, watching his YouTube. And he posted this older- It was, like, an edited clip from, like, I think it was, like, three months ago. But he was talking about how, as he's gotten older, older he's enjoyed, like, just, like, the quiet of everything. And he was basically saying, <laughs> he's like, he doesn't mind dead air in streams because he's like, you know, it's like fucking annoying if you're talking the whole time. <laughs> and it's like, yeah. And he, he, he literally said, he's like, all the little like zoomers who play Minecraft, like expect you to talk the whole time. But you know, they need to appreciate silence and dead air sometimes. And I was like, yeah, it's a good take. Because <laughs> I know for me, if I find, like, a new streamer or a new, like, creator that I like, it does take a while to, like, warm up to them and, like, get used to, like, their dynamic and their personality. So I don't necessarily, like, mind dead air. But, like, I know for me, I like to have something on in the background to, like, distract me. Because, like, I find when I have, like, something, like, auditory playing, it kind of, like, puts my mind at ease. Because, like, if I'm not listening to anything, then, like, this anxiety brain kicks in. So that's why, like, even when I'm offline, like, I'm, I'm always, like, listening to music or, like, listening to podcasts. So it's, like, if I'm in a stream and there's more than, like, let's say a minute of dead air, like, I if I have, like, the screen off or something, I'm like, did they end? Like, did they F or something? But... I understand, like, his POV where, like, you don't necessarily have to be talking the whole time. And I guess that was reassuring to me. Because I know I try and keep talking for the most part. But I know there's times where I'm more quiet. Like, if I'm focusing. <laughs> or, like... If there's... If I can't think of anything, like, productive to say, I guess... Yeah, I agree. I like listening to the streams or music as I'm playing games as well. I think it was Nixon Chat who said earlier this week that they like playing Animal Crossing at the same time I do. It feels like we're playing together, and I was like, oh, that's so cute. Um, because I think the be the best way I can equate a stream to is like you're sitting in the room next to them as they're playing a game, 
And you guys are just chatting or talking. I think that's also why, like, just streams in general is, like, like, those people have the most, like, parasocial fans and stuff. Because you're- you're live for hours on end, so you get a lot of insight into, like, the streamer's, like, personality, like, IRL. Because, like, you can't necessarily be in character the whole time. Did I not bring more axes? I don't think I picked up more axes. <sighs> I didn't. God dang it. Tartar sauce. <laughs> um... <laughs> Okay, when I was younger, I, like, refused to curse. Like, my parents were like, don't you dare curse. And I was like, okay, parents, I won't curse. I won't do it. So, I would always say, like, Spongebob, like, curse words. So I would say, like, tar tartar sauce, barnacles. Because that's what you'd hear on this show, right? <laughs> I just think it's so funny. Yeah, cause like- Oh wait, no, wrong button, wrong button. No, I don't wanna go back, I don't wanna go back. No, wait! I wanna stay! Okay, I wanna buy one more axe and see if I can craft a sturdier axe. Yeah, I know my stream time, it's in the middle of the day for me, like right now it's 12.32pm. So it's in the middle of the day, but usually when I end, that's when like a few of my friends go live. Or like streamers that I like watching go live because a lot of people stream in the evening. And like just chilling listening to something is such like a nice way to decompress and like kind of like calm down from the day. Favorite, favorite villager is Tabby? Who's Tabby? Okay, just hearing the name Tabby, they sound annoying. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> She's so cool. Which one's Tabby? I don't think I've had Tabby before. He's so cool. Oh, it's a cat? Okay. I, st I still think, hands down, Aurora is my favorite. Nothing will beat her. Yeah, I think I will get three of each tulip. I think that will be substantial. It's weird to think how wholesome I used to be when I was little. Because, like, I never used to curse. I used to be such a goody good. And by that, I mean I snitched on a lot of people in the class. And, like, looking at my personality now... Like, I feel a lot more, like, true to myself. Because, like, when you're little, like, you have to listen to your parents. So, like, I understand why I acted, like, so goody-good. I think I've definitely become, like, a lot of brazen as I've gotten older. Like, a lot more blunt. Yes, I am a snitch. <laughs> See, okay, I only snitch if people do bad things. Okay? Okay. I'm not a horrible person. <laughs> Used to curse to yourself? I never used to do that. Like, I wouldn't even, like, mumble curse words, like, if someone did something, like, kind of mean. I would just be like, dang it. I think because one time in, like, second grade, I wasn't put in detention, but... What was it? Oh, we- okay. In school? They, they don't- they wouldn't make you skip lunch. They would make you, like, start lunch, like, ten minutes later. If you, like, act it up. So, like, you wouldn't get first picks on lunch, on lunch, right? And I remember, I I got into this argument with my friend. Because, who was it? I said stupid or something. And he was like, stupid's a bad word. Or wait, no, I think it was the other way around. I think I was saying stupid was a bad word. <laughs> and, like, we were arguing. And then the teacher was like, don't do that shit. And then she made us get our lunches, like, ten minutes late. So we only had, like... 15 minutes to eat our lunch.
Because me and that friend, we were both goody goods. <laughs> so we were both like, oh no, like we fucked up. We messed up this time. Yeah, I agree. Like, a lot of stuff you'll see in elementary is low-key kind of fucked up looking back at it. Because, like, you'll hear so many stories of, like, teachers, like, okay, you can't necessarily discipline the kids anymore. Like, you can't be breaking out your belts or rulers. But also, like, when I was in elementary, that was the time where, like, teachers could still yell at students. And looking back, I don't understand how that was, like, it allowed... And also, like, kind of like the mob mentality, like, I remember in a lot of my elementary classes, they would have, like, a marble jar. So anytime, like, the class did something good, or, or like, everyone did well in a test, she'd put marbles in the jar. And anytime a kid would act up, she would take marbles out of the jar. And then all the kids would, like, harass the kid that acted up and, like, give him shit about it. And it's like, I understand how that could be a good thing, but, like, having all the classmates, like, dog pile verbally one student didn't even fail like you're basically like ostracizing and like highlighting highlighting individual who's already probably like having like troubles on their own like i don't see how it's productive or helpful okay i think i've gotten everything from the island it appears there's no villagers on this island Sag. <gasps> no they didn't they did not do that i mean that that is so fucked up because, like, when I was in school, there was obviously a smart class and then a dumb class. Like, I think Bert Kreischer has a good, like, stand-up bit about it. But there was obviously the smart kids and the not-so-smart kids, right? But they put them in separate classes. But, like, separating them by, like, their seating chart? Fucked up, dude. No, oh, it's not a rare fish, Sag. Like, I can't think of anything else too crazy that happened in elementary. Oh, dude, there was a kid who threw a desk in the classroom. I was there for it. <laughs> okay, granted, this kid um should have been in like a like special help class, in 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 the sense of like they didn't they weren't like. Uh, what's a nice way of saying it? Like, they didn't know how to, like, communicate. Like, they could have been on the spectrum, so... They, they essentially, like, threw a tantrum. And it just kept escalating, escalating. He was throwing, like, chairs and desks in the classroom. This was in third grade. And, like, this student was, like, big for their age. Um. So it's, like... I think that was the craziest thing that happened. But, yeah. <gasps> no, that... Okay, that teacher should be fired. That is honestly so fucked up. I mean, that is literally so fucked up. Because, like, I understand, like, wanting to promote, like, good behaviors. But, like, ostracizing individual students is not cool. That, like, it's only encouraging, like, bullying, right? Like, I feel like teachers bullied kids more than the students did. I don't know. Hey Rose! Welcome to stream, hope you're doing well today. We we're talking about <laughs> teachers being mean and bullying kids. <laughs> but I hope you're doing well today, hon. Yeah, you came in to stream right at the end yesterday and it felt so bad. Okay, so we got some tulips. Let's go ahead and plant our tulips, drop off our stuff, and then go on the hunt for my one true love, Aurora.
busy with the kids. Yeah, I can imagine. Like, I'm not looking forward to summer. Like, I cannot handle, like, hot weather there at all. And we do not have AC in my house. So sometimes during summer, like, we'll just, like, take refuge in my neighbor's house. Because, like, she's older. She's a bit more well-off than we are. So she has, like, this nice AC. <laughs> so we'll just hang out at her house for, like, sometimes all day. <laughs> But I'm glad you're spending some time chilling with me today, Rose. And like, what also sucks, like, I'm not sure how much I'm gonna be able to stream during summertime. Because the way, like, my bedroom, I literally get direct sunlight from like 12 to 8 p.m. And it gets so fucking hot <laughs> so I don't know how it will go because like one I have to think about my safety because being locked in your room all day during summer is probably not the best like I don't want to get heat stroke and also like um, I don't know if the laptop can like handle getting overheated sometimes so we'll, we'll see how that goes <laughs> um I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. Maybe I just have to have like 5 million fans running in my room? Cause like, I can adjust my like microphone to like, I guess cut out the, the humming sound. But then I would have to like, talk this close to it and I don't like that. So I'll have to- I'll have to tinker with it. <clears throat> yeah, exactly. Like, my- my computer right now, I have the fans set to um... What, what would you call it? Like, dynamic settings? Like, whenever it's, like, working more, it'll, like, go, it'll go louder. Like, the fans will work harder. And then if I'm not running too much, then the fans are softer. But if it's during summertime, they're probably gonna have to be, like, on, like, full blast the whole time. Do I laptop fan? Yeah, it's all interior. Like, it's on full blast right now. I don't know if you can hear it. Like, because, like, I'll listen back to stream. To, like see how the audio is and stuff and the only time i can really hear the hum of the fans if if i have my volume on at like 100 percent. otherwise i've adjusted my mic to like where you can't really hear the fans because i know it's annoying to hear in the background oh the oh the, you can put under it i've thought about it but maybe maybe i'll have to look into it there's a lot of stuff I have to look into now that I think about it. I have to look into, like, emulators, potential fans. Oh, but honestly, I should start looking into the fans now since summer is approaching. But let's write that on my to-do list. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's drop our stuff off and get ready for our next island expedition. It's a good investment. Okay, I'll definitely- I'll look into that this weekend. Because if that will help, then that'll be great. I'm just gonna put everything in storage. I, d I don't want to stop at the store today. We're putting everything in our junk box. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I wonder, since we have like full plots, like all our houses are sold. Are we even gonna get, like, a random villager? 
I don't need it. I have enough. But I have enough dragonflies. Wait, no. I think I need one more. I need one more for my collection. Ready, go. I lost her. <laughs> no, I lost it. Frick. God damn it. We'll get it next time. Oh, I also caught a scorpion last night. I caught one and then the next one stung me. So it's one for one scorpions. <laughs> Over here. Okay, so we're gonna grab a few more axes, and then head out. We're gonna find her. Hopefully. I need her back. Okay, let's go. We have everything? Yes. Okay, let's go ahead and get a prediction up. Will we find her? <laughs> Okay, prediction is up, guys. Go Gamba. Will we find Aurora on this island? It is currently zero for three. We tried three times yesterday. No luck. I was gonna say, if we find her, it's gonna smear my mascara, but I literally don't wear makeup, so that joke makes, joke makes no sense for me. We got six. We got a hundred in doubt. Okay. Does nobody think we're gonna find her? I need a. I need like a glimmer of hope. Yeah. Let's see. Please, I need her. <laughs> like I said earlier, are we even gonna get like a villager? Okay, they're probably at the tippy top if they are here. Oh, wait, wait. I think it is true. Yeah, Aurora's the penguin. I think we only get villagers if we have an empty plot. Yeah, somebody's already moving in. We saw it. It was, um, Flo. Oh, what's this a waste? Did we waste a whole ticket? And by we, I mean me. Oh, no. Okay. Um, this is awkward. You need an empty spot? Ah, we need- uh -huh. Okay, well, I'll delete the prediction to make it fair, cause... Obviously, she- there was gonna be no chance. So, refunded. You guys get a refund. Oh. Sag. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. <laughs> Okay, well, I guess we'll search for her again when someone leaves. What does the flex redeem do? It does- it's just a flex. It does nothing. Maybe I'll, like, flex my guns? Maybe? Maybe I can do that. <laughs> but it does nothing. It's just to, like, be like, ooh, I got 10k, look at me. <laughs> I, I think those type of redeems are funny, because I think it was Conrad's fans. He has a point of- he has, like, a few point redemptions, that it's, like, a thousand, 10k, and then, like, a hundred k, where it's, like, Make a donation to the Connor Eats Pants Fund. And it, it, like, the reward does nothing. It's just to, like, boast that you have a lot of points. It's funny. Dude, I'm 
sad. Who did I lose? Aurora. And there's no chance of us finding her today because we don't have an empty plot of land. So... It, today's been an L. It's been an L. Sad day. Okay, at least we can get more resources, you know, that's I. that's fine. <laughs> oh, I should probably get some fruit. That way I can... ...smash these rocks. <laughs> yeah, I miss her too. Okay, so if anybody was here months ago... ...from my first affiliate stream, I deleted my Animal Crossing Island. And that was a whole ordeal, right? What if... Yeah, I'll run this by you guys. What if... And if Megan one day becomes partner, should I delete this island and start a new one? Thoughts? Granted, you guys have a lot of time to think about that. Because, <laughs> okay. I know, like, becoming partner is, like, the dream for any streamer. But honestly? I just want the badge... I, Cause like, I'm not necessarily like shooting for a partner. Like, it'd be cool. It's kinda like a flex, right, if you have the badge, but also like, what benefits do you really get? Okay, you do get to change your emote prefix. That is the- that is literally the only thing I want. Like, I just wanna change my emote prefix to like, Meg or Peace. Like, that is what I want, that is ideally. Okay, yeah, that'd be great if I could do that. Guys, we're grinding for partner. Change the title. Grinding for partner. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, yeah. I, I was debating it. But, like, it'll be a while. It'll be a long time before even close to be eligible. Um. I mean, it's not something that I necessarily want. Like. But anyway. Okay, Hot take, hot take. Isn't that kinda cringe? When people have in like their stream title grinding for affiliate or grinding for partner. It, isn't that like a little bit cringe? Because then just based on like, if that's the first thing I see on your channel, like your title, or like the stream you're currently live in, I'm like, is that all you really care about? Is that like, do you only care about numbers? Like that, that's kinda cringe. <laughs> and that's my take. Based Megan take is always... It creates excitement. I think a little bit. A little bit, yeah. But like, is that title gonna bring people in the stream? That's, that's my thing. Because like, out of everything you can do concerning like, bringing people into your channel, like your title is like one of the more important things. That's why, like, I usually try and click bait the shit out of my title. <laughs> because, like, I understand, like, a lot of the people who come into stream are, like, people who've already been to a stream. Oh. I need more fruit. Because, <clears throat> like, I've heard, like, takes on both sides, and I'm still, like... Eh. It's just kind of, like... It feels weird. Okay, because also, because also, like, you have people coming in who are, like, gonna be there to, like, help you reach the Mindstone, whether it be, like, partner or affiliate. But, like, are those people gonna come back? Like, that's my concern. That's why, like, granted, we have a few regulars in chat. Shoutouts, I appreciate you guys a lot. But I think, like... Your concept or, like, your content for stream has to be substantial enough to keep people coming back. Like, okay, also... I myself have fallen victim to this as well. Like, you'll see posts on, like, Twitter or, like, IG where they're like, Ooh! Comment on this post and I'll check on your channel. It's not follow for follow, but it's kinda is, you know? And, like... I remember this one girl. Like, she posted a TikTok, she's like, oh, you know, I'm new, I just started streaming last month, I'm so close to affiliate, let's hit it, right? And she gained, because I went into her stream that night, because I saw it on TikTok, I was like, oh, I'll check it out, I'll check it out. And, like, 
she gained like a hundred followers on Twitch that day. And I was like, whoa, that is crazy. That is insane. That is wild. And like she averaged like 10 viewers that stream. Crazy, right? But then after that, like I, I checked out her channel and like numbers are down is what I will say. Numbers are down. So I feel like it does bring people into stream. But they're not necessarily people who are gonna, like, stick around and enjoy the content, is what I think. Because, like, when I was, like, first starting out, I never titled my stuff. Oh, fuck. He- He steps back, turn around, retrieve the net. Easy clap. I'm a pro gamer. One for Megan, zero for bees. Right now, I'm at 100% success rate, guys. Pro gamer here. <laughs> um... Yeah, let's fucking go. Dude, I'm, I'm correct. Because, like, when I was, like, starting out streaming, it, it was a long time before I qualified for affiliate, and, like, I wasn't mad about it. Because in my head, like, I feel like, like I said earlier, like, your content or your stream has to be, like, good enough for people who don't know you to watch, right? That's why, like, I never told my friends to lurk in my stream. I would, because, like, I could have easily had, like, three friends have a tab open for me, hit the numbers, get affiliate, let's go. Like, I could have done that. But I didn't want to. Because... Th that would be too easy, right? Like, I like a challenge. <laughs> Loki high key. Sometimes I want to, like, take the easier route, but, like... For something like this, like, I want to take it seriously. Because, like, a lot of people in chat are... People who didn't know me, or people who found me on other platforms and came here. I mean, that's just my thoughts on it. Like, there's no, like, there's no shame with doing things a different way. But I just feel like it was best for me, I guess. Literally yesterday, I said I was not going to talk about streaming when we played Emma Crossing, but I, that's literally all I've talked about so far. Sag. I mean, it's fine, because, like, I think streaming and making content is such a big part of my life now. Because, like, if you just look at, like, the hours I spend a day on it. Like, on days where I stream, I, I'm usually live for, like, three to four hours, depending on what we do. And also, like, I usually spend... On most days, like, an hour or two editing right before I go to bed. So that's a solid, like, five to six hours, right? Like, that's a huge piece of your day. Oop. Are we back? Okay, we are back. The, the wind is popping off right now. <laughs> Um, <clears throat> I just need to go do shit. I need to go do stuff. I need to, like, uh, I need to, like, get a real job. <laughs> but, like, I know if I do get a real job, I'm not gonna be able to stream. And it sucks to, like, think about that. Because I don't want to, like, let people down. <laughs> but I feel like if you're gonna pursue your passion... You should go for it, like, full scent. Like, put all your time and effort into it. Yeah, I agree. It is time-consuming, but, like, I enjoy doing it. Like, it's fun. Editing is fun. Oh, I messed up! I thought it was a three-tapper, but it was gonna be a four-tapper. Frick. Okay, we're gonna do one lap around, see if there's any fish. And, like, thankfully, my parents are nice enough to, like, help support me. They said they'll let me stay here for another year. Let's go. 
So you got another year with me, guys. <laughs> but I feel like if you can't invest the like proper time or like energy into something, like wait to start pursuing that passion until you do, because it's just gonna stress you out. That's why they always say you can only like focus on two things, whether it be like school, work, and like social life. You can't do all three. It's insane. Yeah, I feel like streaming is expensive, but like once you have all the equipment, you're set. Because out of everything I purchased, I feel like the total was maybe 3500 because I bought the new laptop, I bought capture cards. No, it's probably like 4000 Because capture cards are fucking expensive. So like, I probably invested like 4 k Which isn't that bad, because like, I, ne I needed a new computer anyway. Like, the most expensive thing was my nice Alienware M17. But like, <clears throat> everything else wasn't that bad. Like, it is definitely like, an expensive like, hobby. Like, it's not for everyone. Like, if you can't afford, afford it, don't do it. But I think when I first started, like, I just wanted an outlet. And I also wanted to, like, talk to people. And I feel like I've stayed, like, true to those values to for the most part, you know? Hmm. <laughs> Like, gaining a following, numbers is cool, and pago. But also, as long as I keep making good stuff, as long as I keep, like, making stuff that people like, I'll be happy. Like, there will come a point in time where Megan has to get a real job and turn off the camera, you know? <clears throat> but you got me for another year. So we'll see where this year takes me. Thank you, Mac. I appreciate it. Because, like, it's very easy to see when people aren't genuine. And I tend to not interact with those people. Like, I keep to myself, I stay in my bubble. I have very few people who I have, like, close to me in terms of content. Like other creators. For that reason. Because, like, I know I do the evil personality as a stick, as a joke, but I don't want it to be real. If I, I, if I ever, like, start becoming an ego maniac, call me out, chatters. Please do it. Become a hate watcher. <laughs> Because, like, I think everyone has the right to criticize. We talked about this yesterday, too. But it's like... What was I gonna say? I was gonna lead into something else. Like, I don't want people to, like, blindly follow me and, like, support anything I do. Like, if one, if one day Megan becomes a crypto bro, that's not good. I chose the wrong path. <laughs> So it's like, if I become a crypto girl, be like, Megan, what are you doing? You had morals, didn't you? Because, <laughs> like, I hate the audiences that will, like, blindly defend their, like, creator when they do, like, actually bad shit. Like, yes, there's a difference between, like, bad behaviors and, like, actual grime. But also, don't be afraid to call me out on stuff. I will riot if you do. <laughs> okay, I think we can do the museum, check that out, and then we can do the Napoleus, because I wanted to end a bit early today. Because we need to be done with stream by 2 o'clock. I need to see Cutie Cinderella bake a cake. <laughs> Okay, let's check out the museum and see what this is all about. 
Dude, I'm so excited because I think the guest they have is Seer, Rich Campbell, and Hassan. Dude. And I think they're all gonna bake a cake or something, and it's gonna be such good content. I am genuinely so excited. I usually don't watch, like, the Twitch Rivals events, but, like, if there's a personality that I like that is on, like, the segment or the show, then I will watch it. That's why I always say, like... I feel like personalities are so powerful. Like, if my favorite streamer switches to YouTube, I will watch them on YouTube. Like, if Hassan switched to YouTube, I would watch him on YouTube. Because I... It's not necessarily that I like the platform. I like the personality. I like their content. So I feel like companies don't realize how... Like, impactful personalities are. I mean, Mixer was a bad example. <laughs> Mixer didn't work out well. It's because Mixer was not established a lot prior. But like a, a platform like YouTube, they already ha they've already been around for years and years, so the audience is already there and established. <laughs> yeah, Mixer was actual dog shit. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, May eighteenth is International Museum Day, and to honor it, we're holding a stamp rally. Please allow me to mo a moment to. <laughs> Please allow me a moment to give a brief explanation of precisely what this most esteemed day is. <clears throat> International Museum Day is a day to understand the educational wonder that only museums can provide. As a collecting place for all types of knowledge, museums are a critical resource for learners far and wide. Indeed, they can spark imaginations, making difficult ideas easier and perhaps even more fun to grasp. But to put it simply, International Museum Day is a day for getting to know your local museum. Now, the stamp rally works thusly. The bug, fish, fossil, and art galleries each have three stamp stations. You must find the stations in each gallery and acquire the stamps. Do so and you'll earn a memento. <clears throat> there are several unique mementos, one for completing the rally in each galley. Ooh, it's true. Do be sure to give it a go whilst perusing the museum's many fun exhibits. Okay. So we're doing a scavenger hunt. You know this is a very much similar to? If anybody knows what geocaching is. Um, my family used to do letterboxing. So geocaching is where like little like capsules and containers are like hidden. You're like a GPS location. And inside the box is like little knickknacks. And you bring your own knickknacks to like kind of switch out. So like if there's like a marble. And you want to switch out the marble for a little, like, figurine. Then you just put it in the box and switch it out. So, letterboxing is similar in the sense where, like, you go out and find, like, little containers. But instead of a GPS location, there's, like, a set of clues. Almost like a puzzle. So you have to follow directions and find the container. And the inside is a stamp. Usually a hand-carved stamp. And then, instead of taking the stamp, you just, like, stamp the image in your journal, put it back, and then find more images. So it's kind of like collecting stickers, almost, but you're collecting, like, images. It's interesting. Is it? How is there none here? Yeah, and also, like, letterboxing and geocaching is another good way to, like, get active. Because a lot of the times they're in, like, Parks or forests, or like sometimes they're in shops. So we used to do that a lot when I was little. I need to fix my capture card. One second. There we go. Just had to reset it. Because usually when it's running too long, it starts lagging a little bit. But it's height is better. And, like, a lot of the stamps that... Because we would also hide our own letter boxes. Oh, there's one. So, like, I know how to carve stamps. And it's essentially, like, printmaking. Because you're essentially carving images out of rubber. So... Oh, why are there two here? <laughs> there's one here. And then, like, five feet away. <laughs> Easy club. <laughs> Like, 
Like, I want to get into stamp carving again. But, like, I want to be able to, like, carve my own images. Like, draw the illustrations and carve it out. Because a lot of the times, like, the images I carved were, like, pictures we found on Pinterest. So. You don't necessarily want to be, like, promoting that you're using other people's illustrations. Like, that's bad. That's copying. That's bad. So. If I ever do st carve stamps again, I will have to, like, make my own illustrations. Oh, I'm back here. Okay. Yeah, like, if any, like, crafting or, like, drawing video comes up on my For You page, I have to watch it. Or, like, I usually will, like, skip through to the end to see the final. <laughs> Yeah, I used to have a stamp for my signature. I actually carved one. I lost it though. <laughs> I can't remember where it is. I, it's probably really small. <laughs> because also in the letter boxes, when you would find it, you would have there'd be like a little journal, and you would stamp your signature in it. That way, people can look through the journal and see who found the box. And I just like the texture of stamps, too. Like, the flat image. Like, it's a very similar aesthetic to, like, pop art. Or, like, you know, like, um, spray paint? How people make stencils? Like, it's you can, like, layer, like, colors and images to it. It's really interesting. Like, layered stamps are the best stamps. Because, like, you can see here the texture. Like, the thick and thin lines. Like, the, the white pop. Dude, I need to start carving stamps again. <laughs> yeah, I have like no art in my museum. It's because like any time the little weasel comes to my island, I forget to talk to him. I want to do more art streams. But, like, not a lot of people like them. I mean, that's fine. But it's also, like... No, okay, not that I should be worrying about numbers, because that's cringe. But... I think the biggest thing, if you stream too often, people will get bored of you, like, over time. So maybe I can do, like, art streams on my alt account. Maybe? Question mark? I'm debating it. Like, I'm still thinking about it. But then it also brings up the point where, like, I feel like art is something that I want to, like, keep to myself. Because, like, anytime we've done an art stream, like, the last art stream we did was painting this wallpaper. Like, it was a five-hour stream. And if I did it offline, I could have gotten it done and probably, like... Okay, this wallpaper took eight hours total. Like, I did five hours on stream. And then three hours offline. So if I would have done it all offline, I probably could have done it, got it... I probably could have gotten it done in like six hours. So I definitely feel like doing art on stream, like it takes a lot longer because I'm focused on like, like talking to chat and also making sure like stream is running well. So I'm not necessarily as focused on like making the actual art. So it's definitely something that I'm still debating, but not at this time. I don't know. Oh, I love this part so much. The blue lighting. So good. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> it's me. Again. Here to stay. <laughs> oh, there it is. Up top. Oh, dude, I hated this stuff. With, like, the exhibits where you can see through the floor. Dude, they give me so much anxiety. I can't do it.
I think a big reason why I like wearing like heels in the game. I don't wear heels IRL. Like I literally don't. Like I, I physically cannot handle it. But I just like the sound. Like the different sounds the heels make. On different surfaces is really cool to me. It's just some nice like ASMR, I guess. Okay, I think we got them all. Sleeping on the job as always. <laughs> Is that a set of stamps I see? <laughs> it's several, in fact. Jolly good. Now to mark your hard work with an oh, with an aptly named completion stamp. Let's see. Without you finished the stamp rally in the fish gallery. Hoot. I say who? Look at you. I say, did you happen to take any photographs of your quest? Oh no. <laughs> your nook phone takes marvelous photos, and the fish rooms make an elegant backdrop, to be sure. My sister literally does not allow me to take any pictures of, of games. She gets mad because she's like, You're taking up storage space on the switch and we have no more space. And I'm like, I know. But I want to take pictures. And she's like, no, you can't. And I'm like, okay, fine. This is technically your Switch. But you know we share it, but it's your Switch. Okay. <clears throat> and without any further ado, here's the memento I promised you. Oh, that rhymed. <laughs> I present to you your very own fish flat. Now to the bugs. For daring to enter their fearsome presence. I give to you another completion stamp. See, I would take pictures too, but she will know. She will know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you finished the stamp rally in the bug exhibit. Why my peak? What a showing. Your willingness to explore the bug rooms with such gusto is admirable. I myself find lingering there quite impossible. And without any further ado, here's the memento I promised you. What is it gonna be? A fish plaque, maybe? Oh wait, this is the bugs. <laughs> I present to you your very own bug plaque. What else? Oh yes, the art exhibit. I'm pleased to present you with this artfully composed completion stamp. There! It pleases me to report that the stamp rally for the art gallery is finished. You've done this owl proud. As I'm sure you saw, the gallery still has quite a ways to go. I know. Dude, I don't like getting scammed, okay? Dude, he's calling me out right now. It's kind of rude. I just want to enjoy the museum. Me doing all the hard work on this island. It is my sincere hope that we receive enough donations to completely fill out our museum. And without any further ado, here is the memento I promised you. I present to you your very own art plaque. Now, should you find yourself exploring the other exhibit rooms, do try collecting stamps there. Someone such as yourself, you should have found it a worthy pursuit. Wait, didn't I find- Oh, wait, I didn't do the fossil one! Damn, I thought I did them all. Okay, we gotta fill one more cue card. You know- Wait, I have a joke, I have a joke. It's another cue for- You guys know what? It's a cue for the ad break. Okay, that, that one, that one could have been better. That one could have been better. <laughs> but, as you guys know- Every hour into stream, I have to run a fulfill my contractual obligation, run a few minutes of ads. But you can avoid that ad break by subscribing for just four ninety nine, just five dollars a month. Skip that ad break, or no, skip your coffee, you didn't get ad previewing, and soup cool sub only emotes all month long. Or if you have a Prime account, you can link it to your Twitch account, you get free Amazon Prime sub every month. Or if we have any secret orders, now's the time to drop some gifted subs. Otherwise. We'll see some of you guys in a few. Get a snack. Get some water if you need it. The ad break is coming. Okay. Back to it. Yeah, I agree.
agree. I think I'm almost done with the fossils section. Because I've been trying to, like, donate and assess my fossils offline, and I think it's almost done. Yeah, I'm missing one there. He also, there's, like... Okay, this is not TMI. This is not TMI. <laughs> Trigger warning pimples, okay? Trigger warning pimples. Mute, for your, mute the stream for a minute if you don't like talking about pimples. But, like, I used to have a lot of acne when I was younger. And I still do now. Like, it's not nearly as bad. But I never had back knee. Thank God. Because back knee is cringe. But, like, I had a lot of, like, pimples, like, in my nose and, like, in my ear. It sucks. And, like, I have a fat one in my ear right now. That's why you'll see me, like, take my earbud in and out. Um. So my ear is in pain. <laughs> I'm, like, usually, as with, like, most any pimple, as long as you put, like, Neosporin on it, like, it'll be fine. But still, like, it hurts. Sag. Anyway, that's all. Trigger warning, pimple is over. <laughs> Yeah, like, it sucks. Because, like, it's inside my ear, so, like, I can't get to it. Like, thankfully, it doesn't rub against my earbud, but, like, it's, like, in my ear canal, and it fucking hurts. And, like, when I was riding this morning, um, like, as I said, I was, like, biking against the wind, so, like, I got, like, hella wind burn, too, so, like, my, my ears are struggling right now. But you know it's fine, it's Ite. Where's me? Where's me? Oh, right here. His eye. Oh wait, look! The spotlight shows up. <laughs> okay, where's the last step? A stamp mod check? There it is. That's usually another reason why I like I like the over the head headsets more, but like I can't wear them for too long. Hi, so welcome back to stream. I was just talking about how I have pimples inside my ear. <laughs> but I hope you're doing well, hun. <laughs> okay, I think we got all the last stamps that we need. Blathers is gonna be so impressed. Yeah, like, I know when I got pimples on my ear for the first time, I was freaking out. I was like, what is wrong with me? I was like, genuinely. That's usually why. I've noticed it's worse in my right ear. That's usually why I don't use my right earbud. But as you guys know, my other earbud broke the other day. So I can't use the left side. And it's, it's sad. But enough about that. Let, I forgot to give a trigger warning. <laughs> trigger warning pimples is done now. <laughs> oh, I see you've collected a set of stamps. Jolly good. And now to mark your hard work with an aptly named completion stamp. Let's see. It's always the left for me. <laughs> for complete opposites, Mac. <laughs> okay. Very well done. You finished the stamp rally in the fossil gallery. <laughs> As the host of these rallies, it pleases me to. To my pin feathers to see you frolic amid the from the fossils. So why is he talking so funny today? <laughs> the views you get as you stand upon the circles on the floor are always such a sight, and the tree of life on the floor, which charts the path of evolution, never fails to tickle my talons. I do hope you took a moment to appreciate it all. If you didn't, then I hope you will. And without any further ado, here is the memento I promised you. I present to you your very own fossil plaque. Hoot! And what what? You've completed all the stamps available today? I think you've enjoyed the stamp rally to such a degree. I can't help but puff my feathers with pride. We'll be holding a stamp rally every day until May 31st. We'll even change the stamp stations each day. If you'd like to earn more of those same mementos, I'll look forward to seeing you again. Thank you so much for celebrating International Museum Day with us and taking part in our stamp rally. Sharing the wonders and knowledge our museum has to offer never fails to make this owl smile. Hey, cool, that was pretty, Pago. 
I don't think I've ever walked through the whole museum. Because I usually just like, I like to go to the butterfly section because I think it's so pretty. The other sections are like, aren't as pretty unless you have them more filled. Okay, so I think it's 1.30 right now. So we gotta, we gotta wrap things up. So let's go ahead and save here and switch gears to You Laugh, You Lose. Like I said, I'll do my dailies offline. Hopefully, we'll have a villager leave, that way we can grind for Aurora next week. Okay. So, go ahead and get that set up. If you're new to stream, the daily schedule is Game of the Day, Animal Crossing, and then you laugh, you lose. I know yesterday we did React. <laughs> did React? React. Oh, I cannot talk. But... Okay, are we back? Looks like you're back. If you still see an off screen, refresh your tab. It looks like we are back. It <laughs> feels lag, man. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. I opened YouTube and it fucking ruined everything. Okay, what I noticed when I was rewatching back the VOD from yesterday with the um, Twitch clips, I think it's too much from a processor, so I have to unplug my game capture card. Because I think that is too much. So let's see. It should be better now. Okay. <laughs> Thank you guys for sticking around. If you still see an F-screen, politely refresh your tab. Okay. Also, while you guys are waiting, gentle reminder, we are doing marker tournament on not this Sunday, but next Sunday. Oh, if I, uh... if I laugh, I am stream. Easy. <laughs> you guys know the rules. Don't need my headsets anymore. Okay. It's YouTube time! You guys know the rules. If I laugh, I am stream. If chat laughs, type one in chat and tell me what made you laugh. I can smile. I cannot laugh. I can pause. The only rule is I cannot laugh. Okay, ready? Ready? Um, <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> they added the boom sound, didn't they? Careful, watch your head. <laughs> Nancy, you go so dead weight. No. Oh. Oh, he had, that was his phone, wasn't it? Wait, wait, wait. Go back. Yeah, that is his phone. Oh, no. Dude, he's probably so fucking drunk. Is there a hole in this? Oh, what the fuck? This game is so damn peaceful, bro. You can do farming too. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, it's his... <laughs> Glad I made you laugh, huh? No. <gasps> what the... F Wait, what? Nani?
think see am i right come out i think half the fun of you laughing lose is like laughing at the person laughing like i freaking love when miss kip does you laughy lose such good content no dude i fucking hate kids wow it's so pretty up here Gotta go, no problem. We'll see you next time, Mac. Enjoy chatting with you as always. We'll see you next week. with the motherfucking Fiji. There's a leaf on that shit. Take this shit out. Oh, dude, homie ate the whole ass cup. Me playing Mario. Too scared to jump. Oh, dude, he bent the whole fucking wheel. Are those razor blades? Oh, no, okay. I, I thought they were dead ass playing with razor blades and I got concerned. That's what he gets for cutting her off. That asshole. What? Oh. What is that? That's raw, bro. <laughs> what the f <laughs> <laughs> the black Phoenix, stop it. Go on. Go. You're going to do it again? Look, this middle-aged mom is just trying to film a video for her Facebook. Oh, and the cat just ruins oh, everything. No. No, he did. No, he <laughs> oh, it's one of those punching machines. He got a one. Ready? Okay, that was actually DUM. Because it's broken, right? Oh, so you gotta turn use that. Oh, we're just gonna <laughs> have a mess of this. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> là, just essaye de lui faire confiance. Parce que là, elle va sauter de super loin. <laughs> Our rabbit used to do that. He'd like hop on the couch and then just like just spaz and hop off. Bro, what the fuck? Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Boo! Come back! Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah. yeah. Pretty quick. Oh, that's not, it's just not fucking normal. Right. What am I seeing there? 
I've seen a fucking lady fucking oh, slide down the stairs. And it's not normal, is it? It's not. It's not right. I've just seen it. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty good. That was good. <laughs> Anybody left? Anybody get gut? Okay. <laughs> Okay, so we did get a gifted sub earlier. I'm gonna go ahead and get the second camera set up. Uh, let's go ahead and get some music on for you guys. Is this a good level or is this too loud? If it's too loud, I can lower it. It's good? Okay. They don't want to have it too loud. <clears throat> okay, right now I'm setting up my phone cam. There she is. Okay. Let's go ahead and change our title. Okay, so if you're new to stream, for anybody who subscribes, cheers, gifts, or donates, you get your name right now. All cute and stuff at the end of stream. Or if you can't afford it, we do have a channel for redemption. In the bottom left corner of your chat box, where I'll write your name for channel points instead of money. <laughs> so enjoy some visual ASMR, guys. So earlier in stream, I did gift myself four subs, Sag. That's part of the game, you know. Oh, also, guys, if we hit 50 subs, chat will get three new sub emotes. So look forward to that, guys. If we hit 50 subs. Three do emotes for chatters. Oh my god, thank you, Tony, for redeeming that. Let's, let's write your name first, Tony. What color should we do? Um, I like a green for you, Tony. I think that would look nice. Green, yeah, because your username on my end is like this almost like emeraldy green. Got the same cool Pago. Let's fucking go. Great minds think alike, am I right?
is Tonito33. There we go. Tonito33. Okay. Then back to our sub journal. Yeah, no problem. I personally, I think the calligraphy is one of my favorite parts of the stream. Mainly because I just like drawing and writing. I think the music is a little bit too. There we go. Hi, Downs. <laughs> Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. Did you have, like, your caps lock on, hun? Yeah, you had caps lock on. Because <laughs> you had the capitalization switch. That's so cute. You're always with the light downs. I say this every time we read out to you, but your laugh is genuinely so contagious. I love it so much. Right now we're thinking subs because we're about to end stream. Sag. So you, you missed the main beat of the show. <laughs> it's always nice seeing you, man. You guys spaced everything out nicely today. I always have a difficulty like connect, like drawing E's next to things. They don't necessarily connect nicely. But that came out pretty good. MEB, my own personal oiler. <laughs> okay, so earlier in stream, me and MEB gift one tier one sub. Also, gentle reminder, Chatters. If we hit 50 subs, Chatters will get three new sub-only emotes. So, chew on that for a little bit. There we go. And maybe with a tier one sub. Let's go. <clears throat> okay. So, I think that's all I got for you guys today. I don't think we're gonna read out today. Because like I said, I'm gonna watch another stream that starts at two, so... We'll probably read out somebody next week. But, let me turn off my phone. As always, I enjoyed hanging out with everyone today. It's a pleasure as always. I did... Oh, dude, I game over how many times? Four times in SM3 World. That's insane. That's a lot. That's okay. Not as bad as some other times, but still, that's a lot. Um, I think we will stick with... Yeah, bye, Downs. <laughs> Literally just came in. I'm sorry, hun. Um, I think we'll stick with the shtick to where any donations will make me lose on I think that's a good concept. I think we'll stick with that. Um, yeah, I think we'll stick with that for now, for any future runs. Catch you soon, no problem, hun. We'll see you next time. Um, what was I gonna say? It feels weird that it's Thursday. Because I know the past two weeks I've streamed on Friday. But it's Thursday. So I will see everyone Tuesday, 11 a.m. PST. If you want to see more of my offline social media accounts, I have a Twitter, Instagram, and a TikTok. If you aren't already, go follow my Twitter. That way you get updates about stream, updates about me, all kinds of cool stuff. Funny qu <laughs> funny tweets sometimes. <laughs> um, yeah, as I said earlier, I will be live again on... How do you spell schedule? On Tuesday, 11 a.m. PST. I think we're going to stick with the schedule for a while. I know we said earlier, once we beat SM3D World, we'll probably do Mario Galaxy. But I don't know what we're going to do after Kirby. But I think we got a lot left for Kirby. So I think we're set. But, yeah. As always, I appreciate anybody who came in the stream. Any viewers, chatters, lurkers. I appreciate everyone. It's always a delight. 
streaming. It's always a good time now. Like, I always feel, like, super nice after stream. So, once again, thank you, everybody, so for being, like, so wholesome and nice. Um, I will see you guys next week. And if you want to see more of me, just follow my offline socials. Easy clap. Okay. <laughs> Bye, guys.